So what is going on guys, this is Ryan here and welcome back to part 2 of Days Gone. This is the zombie survival horror game I've been waiting for for the longest time. And honestly, I'm so glad it's delivered on all of my expectations so far. I am so excited to get back into this game. Because of that as well, I'm going to keep this intro super short. Because the world for this game, like, I want it, okay, right now. Before I do that, however, I am trying to keep this as a daily series. And I mean, so long as you guys are continually enjoying this and you're know, also leaving that like right down below. I am going to do my best to keep doing this as a daily thing. So if you do want the next episode tomorrow, yeah, you already know what to do. Come on, I've told you. Guys, I just couldn't wait, okay? I don't even know what I said in the intro. I just gotta play this game some more. Look how beautiful the Damn views it. are. Damn Loser, your arm's not gonna be fine. Don't talk about the bad stuff. I'm looking at this beautiful view right now. In the last episode, though, guys, we kind of got introduced to this world, and I did the little bit after this here, which was where someone's spying on the camp. You can actually see the dude. Look at him taking a jog right there. You better start running. I'm about to pop your butt cheeks. Now, in the last episode, we actually took care of this small camp here. So we're gonna do short work, guys. Let's do this. Bro, you're shooting his trash work on that. Well, I am okay. <laughs> Two bullets, one left. Ooh, missed. Last bullet right here, guys. Making it count. That's how we do it. All right, guys, we are finally back now to where we was before. Just did a little bit of looting. The current dilemma then is that Deacon doesn't have his bike because it's got a problem. And I think we now have all the parts to actually fix that up. Boozer as well. His arm is not looking good. Honestly, I think a bit of booze will probably do him some good at this point. The plan though appears that we need it to head up north for whatever reason. Seems like we just want to change the scenery for the most part. Maybe that's all we need. Aye. What the freak is this down here? Take some of that. Wild Burma God. The freak is a Bermagot. So we'll have to try and find out what Bermagot exactly is down the line. For now, though, I guess all we need to do is really go on back and try and find our bike. 322 meters in that direction. Oh, damn freakers. I was going to say, there's a lot more. So swarmers are sensitive to light, feeding mostly at night or during heavy storms. Got it. So in that case, then, almost the light itself is the weapon that we need. Maybe not so much the gun itself. And in fact, I'm going to swap out for the silencer. Making noise isn't always the best thing to do. See if you right there. So we're gonna mark him up and also this one. You know, there are so many though of these freakers around. It's like trying to find a safe way through if there even is one that is. You know what? This path here is looking decently safe, I would say. I'm gonna patrol on there, so let's hop down. That way is no good. There's a lot there. Now, can I actually loot this? I can. And I'm actually gonna do it, even though there's a lot around. Should just about be okay. And we're max on parts, so great. Two to my right hand side, and we can always use some more of that. Thing that's for making the crossbow bolts, but not 100 percent just yet. Just focus on moving up in the safest way. Bad weather can affect your enemy's ability to see in here. It can also affect conditions and trails for the roads, I think, pretty much. Guess that makes sense. So we have a little bit more stealth here. It's like a rebound effect, though, because whilst they can't hear us, we also can't hear them as well. Oh, damn rain. Yeah, if a lot of it, too. Freaks, it's the goddamn rain. Oh, yeah. Why? And then the cold that comes after. Is it always raining? And everything else. <laughs> Take a look around here. Freak it just down there. Seems like they're not sticking the towards the top I? of the mountains. I We're in a good spot. Close. Yeah, we are, my dude. Just keep it together. Nearly there. We crouch here. A couple of freakers down by this car. So we don't want to go that route there. Just hope going over the mountain top actually leads to a safer way. So hop up over here. And we can't. Okay, we got to go down. We're going to try and sneak this. I don't like my odds, to be honest. There's quite a few there. See the red in the bottom corner with the map. I don't know if that means that he sees us or knows we're nearby. Either way, not worth the risk. Bro, they better not be coming to investigate what the freak's going on over here. Uh, I'm about to have to use the bullet on your forehead, I think. Would you see? Maybe not. No, they're just simply patrolling. Less than 100 meters to go. This way looks good to me. Don't see any of the freakers this side. Want well, the gun just to be safe. Be close. Dude, we're yeah, getting there. Be where the fuck you need some patience, this dude. That's one rag down there, and also I think that's some bandages. Nice. What was that? Was that one down by the embankment? Don't think so. Aha! There's the sign we saw before. So I'm actually going to go prone. This is where we left it. It is. But is there anyone else nearby? It's not by the looks of things. No ambush waiting for us either. I think my odds are about as good as they're ever going to be. Nice clear path. Wait, what the freak? Is my bike under there? I did not see my bike. Hold up a sec. My bike's gone. What the? We need that back. Pronto. Dude, get mad. There you go. Damn it, Copeland. Is that who took it then? Hey! You're from Someone's Copeland's watching, hold up! Do I wanna draw my gun? I guess I'm gonna! Hey, stop. Do I wanna God shoot him? God, are we gonna have to hey, chase him down? Then stop running! I'm Make it simple for you. yourself! Stop running! Bro. I don't know about this. Hey. Just slow up then! Dude, he's gonna get us killed. Oh, God damn it. Right now, I'm gonna kill 
<laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Aggression show comes out. What? Deacon, you're stamina, you bro. Something to be desired. <laughs> yeah, Honestly. Get your bike. Nope. Copeland's men got to it before I did. I'm heading to his camp. I'm trying to. Deacon out. Come on, Deacon. Your stamina is so poor right now. It's embarrassing. Freak right there. You know what? Turn the light off. Maybe we can stay in the stealth a little bit longer without it. Go through this a little bit. He's got his light source out. I don't know if I'm being chased. Hold up. Nothing behind me, so no freakers. But he's running straight back to this camp right here. Dude, you've led us back to the gold mine. Now give me my bike. Here we go. Reynolds. Dude, I'm following shortly behind. Look at this foundation they've built themselves, though. Nice little fortification drop right there, if I don't say so myself. Now, where's my bike? Some son of a bitch stole my bike! I know nothing about that. Better yeah, this is right. So, Copeland's camp. Martial law in effect? Yeah, that's where I'm headed. Okay, so here we go. Find Manny. Drifters on the mountain. This is so cool, though. Look at this. They've got, like, a civilization bounty. So we can hunt specific things. How's it going? Can we chat some? Turning in bounties. Freaker ears that can be collected and turned into encampment bounty collectors for trust and credits. Different freakers provide different rewards. All right. Let's take a look at this then. So we have quite a few. Do I want to do this? Because I don't really know what I can get for it. Alrighty then. I'll sell a few of these. Nothing one. to lose. And that gets Just us trust with the, the Copeland's one. camp. I mean, I saw you about seven, so, you know, Back. be quiet. I'm not looking for trouble Much today. Yeah. All right. What the freak is hey, going Manny. on? Did I go to the merchant? Hey, I haven't seen you in a while lately. Oh, you've been too busy to notice. Nose mm -hmm. down. You work hard, they feed you. Yeah, camper's life. Great. Yeah, camper's life. Something to be desired. I read a book like once. Zen and the Art of Bike Repair. You ever read it? No, I didn't have a lot of time for books back in the day. Talking yeah. to bikes. I ran a shop. Farewell. Made all the grease monkeys read it. Being a mechanic requires great peace of mind, it said. Try working on an empty stomach. That'll focus your mind. <laughs> Manny, I'm looking for a bike. Yeah? Straight oh. down to the point. Oh, oh, You don't want that one. The freak not. Why not? It just came off the truck. I mean, some dumb son of a bitch left it out in the sh Rusted up big. It rode Manny. hard, too. Before I mean... the road, it didn't know shit about bikes. <laughs> that right? Yeah, that's right. Shot oh, that out this one. We just partied it out. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't even have a fuel pump. We could have used oh, that. Man, fuel pump. Hold like up this a sec. One. Okay, like this one. Yeah, you messed up, oh, Manny. Okay, okay. See, now when I said fool, what I meant was mm -hmm. the fools that brought that bike in. See, they didn't tie that down properly, so they left it like rattling around sure. back there. Sure, like, sure, sure. Let's talk. Wow. Almost glad that dude butted in. Manny, you did no favors for yourself right there. Jeez. Looks like you had some trouble. Oh yeah, you can say that. Hard last night. Rippers again. Something like that, I suppose. So, well, let's talk with him. Up here. Some say looking for you and Boozer. Okay. Um, the sh folks say a lot of things. I'm sure they do. Got a kitchen there, as well. bro. Uh, can you hold up a sec? I gotta get some food. Folks around here take care of their own. Hey, bro. I'm like ten foot behind you. Can you wait a second? <laughs> Lake not holding out. We have to just shout to this dude. Here we go. Okay. Like everything else. Pretty much by the sounds of things. Okay. Look how this has like tears though to it. It's really cool, man. Like these dudes must have like knuckled down and built this. We build deer blinds out here. Put down salt licks below us. Pick them off clean. Try doing that with some freakers, you know. Venison. We couldn't eat it all. I didn't Luxury, think that right? was legal. Deer baiting back in the day. My old man had only one law. The United States Constitution. Mm -hmm. He can only see us now. America. The progress we've all made. Land of the free. Sure thing. We are that. Uh, even the freak is having the freedom by this point as well. We're heading up to the top floor though. What is the deal? Let's talk, man. I saw Leon the other day. Yeah? You won't see him again? He was bringing me something. Is that right? Folks here in a lot of pain, Deke. Take your hand out your pocket, oh, seriously. Leon. <laughs> Wait. Doug said that he took off. No one's seen him. Mm. That's our excuse then, huh? <laughs> I think he knows different, Tell you right? What. You find his stash. Okay. You bring it to me. To me, Deke. You do that. Well, we'll see what we can do for you. In terms of? The bike. 
That your men stole, that your men parted out. That's salvage, the problem, right? Deke. Salvage. All right. Just like your face by this point, huh? Keep that in mind. By the way, nice hat. What? No, this one. Don't you ever die. Oh. Hold on. Oh boy. Leon wore a hat like this, didn't he? Oh, cool. I he swear might to God. Have. Don't. What's he gonna do? You wanna do business in my camp? You start doing some runs for me. Oh, come on, man. Gosh. Okay. I'm here anyway. What do you got? Trash into the bag. Like a group of drifters has been harassing my supply runs. You They've moved into the radio me. tower west of O'Leary Mountain. Isn't that your backyard? No, it's not, but uh, I'll take care of them. I Guess thought you, got no you choice. Might. Yeah, I bet you did. Kind of gave us no choice with that one. Bro, we're messing with the wrong people. Why can't I pull out my gun right now? You know, this is also a very different playthrough on the channel because it's a lot more slower paced. The story kind of builds throughout like, I think a 20 to 30 hour experience. So guys, this is obviously going to be edited a little bit different. And to be honest, I hope you do still enjoy all this because it's a lot of fun for me to play so far and very, very different. Hold up a second. First of all, we got the mechanic prom right there. Dig, dig. Hold up. Did he fix I just want to say how sorry I am. I, I didn't know, I swear. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Have any idea how much time I put into that bike? It was a drifter bike, Manny. I know, hey. I know. I I'll make it up to you, I swear. Okay. I, I put together a new one. Which I just saw. <laughs> you call this piece of bike? <laughs> I know. It's not. Oh, Look, man. I'll keep an eye out for, for more parts. I'll hook you up. I swear. Oh, you okay, better. Okay, what about my custom gas tank, Manny? You know, the one that I got for my dead wife. You gonna keep an eye out for that one, too? Jesus, Deke, I'm sorry. Just get the fuck out of my way. Dang, Manny, you seriously hey. messed up. What the frig do you want? All right, I'll take it. Wait, if I continue, so Copeland's camp, 1,000 trust out of 5,000. It's like a ranking system and gear up for the ride. So there's a load of different storylines developing. We've got gear up for the ride. We've got ripped apart. It's really interesting. You can see we can do basically anything we want in whatever order we want. Now, what the freak do you want to know? New skill point, by the way. That's something I didn't spend in the last episode. So if we swipe on down, we've got two skill points, or rather I've got two skill levels and one skill point. All right, so we have escape artists to kill smaller enemies after successfully escaping from a grapple, the ability to repair melee weapons, and the last one is improves the initial recovery and duration of a stamina cocktail. Also in the range, we've got all these different stuff and also survival. So we can really build our character however we want. The ability to follow a melee attack with a ranged attack for massive damage. Perhaps that one seems like a decent one to get. May just as well. So vicious cycle has been mastered. Don't stop me now. Press R2 to perform the melee attack and hold L2 and tap R2 to perform a ranged attack. I'm gonna forget that. Download incomplete, go explore Copeland's camp. I've been running around this map for literally 20 minutes, guys. It's literally locked me in the camp space. I don't know what else I can do. Okay, so randomly after actually entering that camp, the game actually needs to download a 16 gigabyte update. So uh, yeah, I've been sitting tight for about 20 minutes, guys. I'll be back. The download just broke my game. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold up a second. Now it's all working again. <laughs> all right, guys. Stop now, excuse me. Okay. Talking of wasting time, I just had to download an 18 gig patch. What the freak do you think you're doing with your life? Yeah, guys, excuse me if I feel a bit like floaty with what's going on right now. It's been a long time since I actually got to play this. If you guys, it's probably like a quick jump cut. But yeah. We got back on the bike, I guess. Not our bike, but hold a bike on. nonetheless. I am, dude. We'll have to hold on for a download. I'm out of this place, man. And I guess this is it. Drifting. Whilst accelerating, tap the circle button to perform a drift. Drifting while turning can help you take corners quicker. All right, let's try this out then. So get our foot down, and then if we tap this button here. Uh, I mean, bro. That's difficult. How you doing? Oh my god. <laughs> we'll try that again in a sec. See how Boots is like doing, though. Said, I'll be fine. Okay, I sure uh, hope so, man. I'm still gonna head to that Nero checkpoint, find some uh -huh. uh, sterile bandages, uh, mm -hmm. ointment, something. Sounds a decent plan, to be honest. Sure, whatever. I'm gonna go out. Make sure the mountain's clear. Some freaking freak is nearby. No, hold up. Okay, get my foot down a sec. To stay there, you rest, okay? I'll be there as soon as I can. He's not gonna listen, is he? Uh, Maybe he is. No idea. I guess. Uh, well, what's good, man? I could. I could do that. You definitely could, honestly. Yeah, We're here yeah, to help, I guess, man. I guess I'll see what I can find. <laughs> we'll help out. That's how you drift, by the way. Oh, let's go, man. That felt good. Saint John. Wait, Coco. We meant to be here. Our radio uplink has been shut down. All right. I'll pay you to restore. Okay, interesting. So, so new missions coming up around. Shutting down radio free organs seems kind of personal. 
I guess so. God Something damn like that. right, it's personal. We just trip. Hold up a second. I'm trying to listen to this a little bit. Seems they didn't like the rules against stealing, raping, murdering. Dang. Well, maybe they're like me, just tired of listening to your paranoid truth or bolt. St. John out. Something like that. Okay, well, this is really getting bad, isn't it? Okay, so right to the Nero checkpoint, bug the hell out. I think I just went ahead and went the wrong way entirely, but that's okay. You know, we're gonna make these travels and then learn as we go. So if we head back to the camp and then maybe go out the other way, that might lead us to where we need to go. Let's go ahead and... <laughs> I thought I was gonna drift right there. Come around these corners nice and sharp. Let me go ahead and drift around this corner here. That's how it's done. A little bit of an overshoot, but look, practice makes perfect. Freak. Okay, I gotta go back. This is the wrong way. All right, let's go back on the road. I feel like we're going about the right way. Don't know if there's possibly a faster route, but we just gotta get back to that Nero camp. I said before as well that there would be some kind of like bandages and also weapons and stuff like that. So I guess once we get there, we can determine. But all these flashbacks. Remember dealing with those guys in the last episode? Bodies still there, not been eaten just yet. It probably will be soon, but here we go, guys. The Nero checkpoint. Might as well slow down here. Sometimes the best strategy is to run away. If you have stamina available, press L3 to sprint. Why the freak would it give me that warning before I go in an enclosed camp? Hold up a second. It has me super paranoid. Go ahead and park the bike up here. Facing the reverse way. So if we need to make a break for it, I guess we can at some sort of good speed. This Danger. is it. The Extreme nearest checkpoint. I gotta price. find some sh for Boozer's arm. That you do. By the way, I've discovered both of their favorite words in this place is obviously sh and then son of a bitch. They love using those words back to back. Okay, restore power to the Nero Mobile Medical Unit. A lot of new side missions coming up, so where could we even find the power to this thing? I have no idea. You know what, let's get some vantage points right now. Also, I'm gonna take the bottle and I think also a rag down there too. We'll climb on the top here. So we've got a freaker just over there patrolling, but how power is restored? I have no idea. What a footstep. To I'm making too much sound. I don't want to shoot him. What we're going to do then is we're going to swap out to the crossbow. Make the shot count. Count it somewhat. Hello, come on, come on, come on, come on. Take another one. I think he's down. That was kind of silent. I don't know about this, dude. That wasn't the best. Yeah, freaking here. He is kind of listening, I think, or she is. Stay on the low. I love that tension music, by the way. Ooh, stay low, my dude. Wait for them to lose their attention, then get back on track. I think we're near enough good. Apart from this one down here, they know something's up. You see that? They're coming for a look. I've got no choice. All right, meet the crossbow. They're looking at the corpse over there. All right, crouch over here. I'm gonna climb back down right now and just pretend I didn't see that. Hop down, make a lot of noise. What is this? So we can hide in there too, in case we really need to. Think about this camp though, there's not that many of the freakers right now. So if we need to deal with them, I guess we can. This dude has no idea we're even here, so I could maybe go for the silent kill. Generator. Oh, Gotta be a generator here somewhere. You wanna get behind him? Kind of way. I wanna make sure he's going the right way. Here we go. Silent takedowns are the way forward. Are you kidding me? That bad look though! Right, let's go, let's go. Take him down. Ooh, just about recovered from that. See you later. So we need to find ourselves a generator. Let's check out towards this side of the camp here. I don't think there'll be a generator. I have no idea where it could be. It's gonna be near the actual things themselves. The one up top there though now has a great vantage point over the top, which is a little bit concerning. I'm just gonna try and think what is the best way to get through here. Okay, let's go inside here. Keep this drawn. There's nothing within. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I can hear one. So she's outside there. Could probably get behind it if we're quick. Their vision isn't the best, that's the thing about them. So we're gonna sneak up behind her. Oh, she sees me. All right, we gotta use the crossbow. Dang, that did nothing right there. Reload up, reload up. Ready to dodge. Ooh, that was real close. Wanna come forward one more time? Alright, I'll take the shot. So I feel this guy. You better start. I really hope it does. Hit the button. Let's find gotta out. Find some gas. Okay. That would have been a lot of noise though if it did start, so maybe it's best it didn't right now. I think I saw gas just in the tent over there. What about this guy over here? Looks like there's some fuel wedged right in between <sighs> stuff. Perfect. So that will have fuel inside. Don't go wasting this. Let's fill the generator up, get things started, and then get everything that we need for Boozer. Get fuel. Oh, there we go. Uh-huh. Should be okay. A little bit of noise nearby. Not enough, though, to distract that us. Be Let's it. not do it. Okay, then we'll press that. There we go. That should give us the power we need. Yes. There we go. So they don't like light. That's going to bring them all down on me. Oh, it is. Okay, so what do we want to do? Get in there quickly or not? Hold on. Let's get the light in here as quick as we can. Wait, really? Bro, open the door. Open the door. See the behind Speakers. 
Or the hell the speakers. Okay, we gotta find this before we get anything stolen. Bandages, there are bandages. That. Where the hell would they keep this? I have no idea. But as you say, the speakers, my dude. We gotta stop this. Searching here real quick. Yes. Come on, Deacon. Bandages. All within that. Uh huh. Now I just gotta get this back to Boozer. How we will be able to. The freak is that a Nero injector? Nero injectors can be found inside Nero mobile medical units at Nero checkpoints. Use them to permanently increase your health, stamina, and focus. Oh yeah. Okay. Now we're talking. So health, stamina, or focus? So we're gonna go stamina, guys. Injector. The best one. Some kind. I'm gonna find out. He shoots it in the arm before he even knows. 25% increase right there, though. Not bad. And a gun locker. But we'll check this real quick. This is probably a bad idea right now. All right, now the biggest problem we have right here is the speakers. I haven't even tried to stop them, so that's a narrow recorder. Hey, freak. You hit it? I'm gonna have to hold this up. Okay. How do you mean, right? Holy crap. Woo! That's what happened. <laughs> Chaos. All right, now we have to disable the stuff right here. Okay, give me that ammunition. Eight rifle ammo. Got a corpse over here. Maybe he's got like a key on him or something that we need. One hypertech, two scrap. No idea what that is. Guys, I really can't find where these speakers are at. I've looked all around the place, so it must be like an outdoor thing. Maybe in the other like small tent thing. I don't want to go out to find out. What we got Come on, Deacon, watch where you're going. Dude, this ain't good. This ain't good. This ain't good. Mm. My god. Sounds like there are so many nearby. There really is. They're chasing me down already. Okay, so just jog for now. Take it chill. Okay, they're running. Stop panicking. All right, we've got what we need. I haven't turned the speakers off, but if I can get on the bike and get the freak back out of here, that's really all that matters. Come on, keep running, keep running. Loser, goddammit, answer me. Yeah. No, we gotta go. We gotta go. He's not picking up. I'm gonna have to go a different route, guys. I really hope Booze is still back at base. That was a near miss, though. We've got the sterile bandages and we got some cool upgrades. Now just getting back to Boozer is the main priority. There's like swarms of freakers everywhere, though. You see that? And your bike is low on fuel. Search for gas. I mean, that's a given, right? Wonder how the bike handles as well in like the wetter conditions. So drift around the corner. It does seem to drift a little bit easier. Slide that way. We gotta get used to this drifting thing, though, guys. If we want to progress and get back, and I guess like avoid this sort of stuff, we gotta do it. By the way, take that. <laughs> Holy crap, we went straight into that wall right there. Slide on through. Let's get back up then to Boozer and see what he says. Hey, Boozer! Quite the storm today, buddy, huh? Quite the storm indeed. Still got the goods for your arm, though. Let's go ahead and get that treated, shall we? Uh, wait, is Boozer in there? Hey, Boozer. I, uh, found some for your arm. Okay. He's got- Boozer. I mean, he's there. I don't want to say he's gone. Not in that context, anyway. Boozer. I hope it's the pain that's hey. made him pass out. Ah! All right. <laughs> blown your goddamn head off. Well, You're right. Uh, you could have, man. Let me see that arm, huh? No, no. I got. Come on, let me see that arm. I come on, man. All right. Stubborn, huh? Very, very stubborn. So that's the sterile bandages. Thanks, brother. He still appreciates it, though. Look, I'll, I'll he's be trying better, to keep his okay? head tough. All right. Fine. At least we got that part of the mission done. Looking out for our brother and all this, you know? Wait, hold up. We blurred back out. So this is a mission complete right there. Bug the hell out. 3k XP. Some more trust for Copeland's camp as well. And we've progressed as well at the story there. Nice. Okay, so we're going to continue. Ooh, no starving patriots though. Is that the next story job? Locate the Cascade Radio Tower ambush camp. And this is for Copeland, I think. The dude wanted us to do that. You know, I think I might do that now. Or should I wait until the day? You know what? The stormy conditions actually do offer cover in these situations, so maybe it's best to actually try and do it now. I guess we can always see what happens. And if worse comes to worst, we can always try again. Or uh, actually, no, we'll be dead. We ain't gonna think like that, though. This is new territory. Never explored this way before. See what sort of crap is heading on this way. Hopefully not as bad, but probably gonna be the exact same. Yep, soon discovering this is just as bad. All right, we're gonna have to get over toward this camp here and definitely search for fuel. What's they left, good? it appears they may have stolen some automatic rifles and a few shotguns. Okay, and you want it back, right? Oh, you saying this is cold of it. Hands up. I mean, he could have told us that way I before we even started this, right? Okay. This is not going to be pretty, guys, but... Yes. Might be the first difficult mission, I guess. Hey. Uh. That's a wall there. Right, we're starting to close in, though. We see this little encampment set up here, so you know what? It's probably best we do stuff off. Not out of ten. Clear. Oh, he's coming right down. Hold up. 
Well, take it easy. Maybe he's going to investigate. Let me see where he goes. Trying to listen. He's like right over there. Hold up. Take this nice and slow. He heard the bike. We can take him out though. Make sure the shot counts and... Bro, you see him flip my bike? How could you? Take the first one down. That was not good though. He shot his rifle. People would have definitely heard that. Search his body. Got one more of the bandages. You know, I'm actually going to heal myself up. I am at 75, but I want to play this extra safe. Alright, another dude coming down. So, crouch down here. We wait in the bushes. I think we're kind of hidden. He's coming up. Oh, he's coming way too close. Bro, take him out! Oh my gosh! He did not see that crap coming. And he's also dropped what looks like an AK. Perfect. SAF. Definitely go ahead and take that one. It's got at least a couple of shots within it, though. I'll also, take these mushrooms down here. Why? I don't know. I just want them. I to do that. You know what? I'm gonna run down a little bit more because I don't want to get caught. And again, let's try the same thing. We'll wait within the bushes. He's coming down too. If he comes down to the same spot, this is about to be real good. Wait, he's going that way. So he's gonna see the dead body. Try to sneak up on him real quick. Oh yeah. And it's about to be a knife in the back of your cranium. There you go. Now, if I don't say so myself, we're doing pretty good so far with this one. Keeping it as discreet as possible. So I am gonna swap back to the crossbow because I really don't want to alert people. And if I miss, I want it to be as silent as possible. Hold up, these guys are talking over here. The hell? Dang, I gotta be really careful. Bro, can I take Man him out coming. maybe from within here? <laughs> that was a bad miss. And they know I'm here, so I may as well go out noisy. Right, here we go. It's one shot. There's another one. Ooh, I took the dude out in the back there by accident. I'll take it. Just behind there. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Just missed. Oh, I'm out of ammo for that thing as well. Dang it. I do like that rifle, but we'll swap out to the 9mm for now. Let's just see what this can do. All right, one shot here. The next one hitting. Come on, take it down. That's three bullets. Four, five bullets. 70% uh, clear. I'm going to run around this way a little bit. Okay, there's a dude right there. He has no idea I'm here, so I'll get in the bushes and line up for a headshot. He really has no idea. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Line that up. Nice, good shot. AI 10 down, so just two left. So I'm assuming then the final two are somewhere within the confinements here. Don't see them off the bat. Let me search one more body. Nine assault rifle ammo two. Nicely done. So whereabouts are they? Got him. Footsteps. Hold up. I can actually do the Screw tracking you. thing, right? Yeah, I need to do that more often. We missed the first shot. That's fine. Come on. Line up for the headshot. But you know what? I'm actually going to take out this gun here. Only got nine bullets, but that's enough. Here we go. I think they're both up there. They are. Ooh. Nice shot. So one final one left. Come on. One headshot. That's shit. How many men have you pissed off? So that's ten done. Guess we'll take the ammo from their corpses too. Okay, so now all we have to do is repair the tower power supply. That's a tongue twister to say. All right, I guess in doing so as well, this is going to give us a pretty nice look around the whole of this place. Despite all the chaos and carnage we can see, there's odd beauty to it all. I definitely have got to get better though with the gunplay in this game. Slightly struggling a bit with my aim. It doesn't matter. We will improve on that as time goes on. Such an awesome looking game. Like, you really can see for miles, it feels like. And I've also just realized I didn't need to climb here at all because uh, the thing I gotta repair is like over there somewhere. So that's good. All right. Just down here. This then. has gotta be the generator, but it's mm -hmm. been shot to hell. Maybe we've got the tools and the knowledge to fix this thing up. How's okay. That you know what we're doing? I should do it. Flip the switch. Please there don't short go. circuit. Sounds like it worked. Like it. The freak you coming from, you Mary? Had bullets, I wouldn't be breathing now, would I? Ooh. She's been caught out. Please, mister. She gave up. So there was 11 here. I don't shoot women if I have a choice. Do I have a choice? I ain't got nothing. I got nowhere to go. Okay. Still turning her away, huh? You brought this partly on yourself. Came up to me with a gun. What else do you expect me to do right now? Jesus Christ. Right? Bunker entrances can be found inside. All the right. Well. Let's... See if they got an underground bunker around here. Got a feeling that I'm staring at right now. Something about that character there. Her name was Mary, which means we're probably going to see her again. Guess we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. But the Northwest Netcom. Apparently an underground system. There it is. Down the edge. Do I really want to go down there? I <laughs> don't know about this. It's bad enough above ground. What the freak goes on down below? Yes, we may as well find out. Deacon's talking about it. Pry open with a knife. I hope it's a shortcut and there's none of the freakers down there as a result. Here we go. Very, very deathly silent down here, though. It's quite the extent on the way down, but they've been storing stuff. You see this? What is the meaning behind this? And like, what is the purpose of this place? Maybe in case you just want to get some rest or something. There is like a sleeping quarters, but not giving us no prompts. I guess we can uh, briefly check in here. I'll scan the place. Got a few items over here. So let's take a look. Something on the desk, in fact. We'll pick hey, this up. This is handy. A map. Nice. All marked up. Yeah, nice. <laughs> 
Why did I have to butt in though when he was talking? Dude, I got a new crafting recipe though, the spike back. I guess they won't be needing it <laughs> Not anymore. Okay. So that's worth finding. So recipes. Newly discovered and craftable recipes are shown in the survival wheel. Alright. So we go ahead and take what looks like some you there? nails up there. Probably nothing. Okay. Sounded like bike engines. Riding somewhere on the mountain. Oh, I need that bat. Hold up a second. I'll take that. I just finished clearing the radio tower for Copeland. I'm, I'm gonna climb the tower, see if I can see anything. We did that before, saw nothing. Guess we'll redo it again for the sake of it. First of all though, let me see if I can actually craft this. So over to this. Look, I can. I can go ahead and craft the spike bat. Why not? All right, nice little tool in case we actually have to need it, which I'm pretty sure we will soon enough. For now though, let's get back up that tower. I hope there's nothing nearby. Yeah, bro, I don't know why you're looking at it like that. You've already climbed it. Get the freak back up it now. Hey, Deke, you okay? First of all, we got Boozer talking to us. Like, like yourself. It's, not, it's nothing. Mm. You know, I just let this drifter get the drop on me. Woman. Lucky for me, she was uh, out of ammo. She and her at the same time. Okay. Yeah. Yes, yes, I let her go. So we shouldn't do that, obviously. One of these days, Deke, that code of yours is going to get you killed. Maybe. There's a code, I yeah, guess. Yeah, well, something's going to do it, right? <laughs> Doesn't matter what. Deacon out. I suppose Jesus, so. what a climb. Ooh, do you see that right. Let's see what the hell Boozer's talking about. I see it on the top of the hilltops there, maybe? Maybe we're not looking for that, All right, we? someone's on the mountain. I see smoke from their campfire. Yeah, that's billowing up. Very obvious, Son right? Bitch. I knew I heard something. Where are they? I'm gonna head out there. You're gonna? I think no, you should hold back a second. It. Boozer, gotta get your arm healed up so Seriously, we can ride the man. hell out of here. I'll yeah, take care. Come on, man. He is so <laughs> adamant, though. It's just... I'm going a little stir crazy here, Dick. By the sounds of it, I can tell. Seriously, Try to stay awake health, in case they head your way. Deacon out. Right? Like, I get he's eager to help and stuff, but he's injured, you know? He'll end up messing almost up there. and it'll probably yeah, be some. Come on, keep going. Almost there. What are you talking about? A new skill point. I'm going to actually take a look at that. But, Boozer, man, I'm worried he's going to end up getting himself killed, and I hope not. Okay, so with the skill point, I for detail sounds like a decent one to get. I for detail mastered. So if we do like a sweep of the area, we'll see all the things a little bit longer. Now, before anything else, I kind of want to see if I can salvage some fuel. So I guess we can see if the cars have anything that we can siphon. It's not giving me the prompt, so I can assume not. Pry up in the boot of this. So it seems like the police cars are always an ammo source. That's definitely worth noting. 18 shots too. That's a lot. Aha! Right down there. What a nice little find. You are coming straight with me and back to my bike. All right, how do we actually fuel this then? Here we go. Listen, oh yeah, you bet. Like getting that chug jug and we are going to be out of here in no time. You know, I think I'm going to follow up with the missions we're doing. That will do nicely. So as for the rest of that, you know, you can go in the fire. There you go. All right, guys. So the last thing we're going to do for this episode then is head now over toward that like camp. The new one that was on top of the hill. I want to see what's popping off up there. Smoke on the mountain, they call it. Let's head 600 meters in that direction. So fortunately not too far. In fact, I'm gonna coast for the most part, because surely this won't use up as much petrol. Honestly, though, I really have no idea. So I'm actually gonna put my foot down. Screw it. St. John to Copeland's yeah. camp. It's done. The radio First tower's anyway. locked down. I've restored your radio bubbling. Now we did. Copy you, go this way you may not see the value in St. John. Okay. But radio Free Oregon is the only thing keeping us from turning into savages. Got it. All right. No, no, the only thing keeping us from turning into savages is about nine square. Why does it keep doing this whenever? <laughs> when landing, you can reduce the damage done to your bike by using L to angle your tires parallel to the ground. All right, well, it's a bit late for that one, Chief. Try going hard for right, three days. There's no such thing as a starving patriot. Got it, got it, got it, sir. Am I the that? Oh, to God, you're wrong about that. Broke it down. All right, man. Get back to this mission. Jesus, we're done. Jesus, done. Jesus, we're done. Have regrets, Deacon? Too Bruce late. Man, you're still following you this awake? up. I'm uh, heading to that camp you spotted north of the mountain. Mm-hmm. Uh, Railway track I heard on gunshots. Okay. Might be an ambush camp. Okay. Almost like a decoy. Find out when I get there. Deacon out. We better take this easy though. Again, I'm gonna stop the bike a little bit further away from the camp. There. Say about here. Who's man? He's gonna say. Right. They set up along the railroad tracks. It's a lot right there. Kill every one of the sons of bitches. All right. Nine total. Deacon. Wait. Can't craft anymore. You got your radio on. Yeah, bro. I got, I got it on. I figured I'd see if I remembered how to make anything. Well, I'm Stop about to kill nine people, so, like. you know, feel free to talk to me about stuff, I guess. Look, they got, like, tripwires and stuff. Dude, how am I going to take these out silently, though? I've got no more crossbow shots, I don't think. I think I've got four. There was a dude down there. He's actually since moved. They have traps around basically every corner. Look, bear traps included, too. This dude patrolling here. Silently, does it? Bro, that was in the back of the neck. Are you kidding me? One more. 
That takes him out. I love how we got shot with an arrow and then just returned back to normal, though. That wasn't good, though. It really wasn't good. Hold on. Let me do a quick scan of the area. Oh, the danger's coming up nearby. Might have to go in loud with this one. Just get the job done. Bro, there's two down here. You know what? Let's take them out. So, there's the first one there. The second one. Oh, come on. Take the third one out. Bro, your shots are weak. Come on. They're all kind of filtering this way, guys. Fourth one right there. Really trying to make these shots count. Ooh. Going with the Molotovs now. Watch the bear trap. There you go. He sits down. 66% health. Should be good. Checking this direction here. No one. All right, you're coming up. Oh, no. You won't hit me with the axe right now. <laughs> oh, she runs into it, though. Okay, she's dealt with two. Let's get back in the action. Let's keep this momentum going. Keep dodging the bullets run this way. And get behind the cover. All right, let's post up. Let's take these guys out. All right, that one's gone. Two more left after. One in the distance there and one more here. Takes care of that one. Wave him to pop his head up. It'll be a matter of time. That's the last of Perfect. Good shooting, man. A lot more efficient than the other one. Barely got hit in that one and took down nine. Right, so that furthers the storyline a little bit more. A lot of corpses now that we can actually loot. I don't want to trigger any of the traps because I don't know if they're like booby traps or something or they might just be like noise traps. Loser, it's done. Squatter camp. They won't be doing any more killing on O'Leary Mountain. Pretty much. Good. This guy as well. Okay. Deke. What's good, man? I should have been there. It's all right. I mean, I... Got the job done. He's starting to feel like he's become Just a weight. Rest up, booze man. Seriously, rest come up. on, bro. Right north as soon as your arm heals. You got that? Yeah, yeah, I hear on. you. Booze are out. Yeah, you can tell he's disappointed in himself, it sounds like, more so than anything else, though. Yeah, we gotta try and change that. This is Radio Free Oregon. There's the a lot of talking with this game, man. Free. Oh, crap. What have I done? The skid rows of this great country. Okay. People Decent so far. The streets in boxes and tents. Mm -hmm. Because they couldn't afford the American dream. Don't tell me that this Some of those good is the bright light. For this Please, come country. on, man. Only okay. to have the feds forget about them as soon as they were done with them. Okay. PTSD it doesn't stand for post-traumatic stress disorder. What? Enlighten me, come on. Put them soldiers down. Ah! We're all homeless now. Wow. Living in the wilderness in the way of our forebears. My gosh. I the guess something like that. Their welfare and handouts to survive. Okay. We showed them how wrong they were. We need I now in that. is a strong will, determination, and trust in each other. I got a Feds feeling he'll use that against us, so you know. Give us that. And you, you want our trust? You cannot burn it. All right. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Okay. Don't believe the lies. Sure thing. Man. That's great. Yeah, Radio yeah. Free Oregon is <laughs> on the air once again. Oh yeah. God, what have I done? I have no idea, man. We both messed up with this one. Deek. Copeland's coming in here. Man, you are one all the time. Coming in my camp, killing folk like we were out in the sh Okay. What's going on, Cope? What's the deal, bro? A man come in, drug out of his mind, shot the place up, then he just took off. Gosh, are you kidding? So you want us to find him, right? He's got a red tank on it, and he was wearing some kind of motocross helmet, silver. Right. Okay, if I go now, I might be able to catch up to him. So is that the next plan, huh? I want Copeland, him alive, what we're gonna do? Alive. That might be difficult. Alive. You catch this man, then radio me. Guess they're Fetch gonna do the dirty work, right? Bastard right from that limb. Yep. It's Take time it, we start so. showing these drifter sons of bitches that we have law and order in this camp. <laughs> no offense meant to yourself. This world is brutal. That's all I'm, I'm saying. Thinking. I'll find it. Let's them. go back in here, though. So we're gonna have to search that down in time, but new mission unlocked, drug out his mind. The free... What are you, what are you looking at? What's wrong with you? Hey, Dick, Another uh, one? Bro, I'm literally right it. outside. <laughs> Dang. Okay. I mean, I'm right outside no, the door, man. No, you know? you're gonna get yourself killed. Uh, you gotta wait till you're whole, brother. <laughs> Literally having this uh, conversation like this. I'm over here anyway, so I'll take care of the mess. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Thanks, Deke. Uh, Deke, wait till tonight. I thought this game was a horror. Hold up. Should be talking about him straight to his face? Is he gonna carry on? Or <laughs> take him out while it's still light out. There'll be more of them, but they won't be as strong. He literally is. <laughs> oh man, this game is definitely having its moment so far. But guys, I think for this one, I'm gonna leave it here because I've been recording for two and a half.
The freak, there's a deer over there. You see that? It was like headbutting the rock or something. This episode in particular though, guys, took two and a half hours nearly because of the update in between. Like, I don't know how much of this I actually played versus waited for the update. I think I want to make these episodes a bit longer though, like more towards an hour long each time. So I think that's going to be the eventual goal. For this one though, guys, this is where we're going to leave this part and part three will be coming real soon. If you guys did enjoy this video though, why not drop me that like rating? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I of course hope you did enjoy and I will of course see you on the next one.